hey guys welcome back to the channel so i put a little base of foundation on my face but i'm going to be using my new cover fx face palette to contour and highlight and blush as well as the ofra um long lasting liquid lip in the shade monaco we received both of these in the march boxy charm box so i'm going to be trying on both of these real quick for you today like i said i already did my eyebrows um i put some mascara on because i don't plan on putting on eyeshadow or anything and i will also be using the brushes that i received in boxy charm for march as well so i'm going to get into this this palette is amazing um i'm gonna well i haven't tried it yet so i'm just saying it looks amazing the mirror is awesome it's very sturdy um, there's what we're working with. This is the light to medium palette, I believe. Yes, light to medium. I was just trying to check for you guys. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be dipping into our contour shade. I'm going to be using this, um, Moda brush. I know this is not like a contouring brush, but it's what I have clean. And I think it fits because I'm trying on everything new from the box turn box of March. So we're going to dip into our contour okay and there is some um, it's kind of loose so be careful mm. okay okay my hair is getting all messed up you guys I'm actually gonna put my hair up so it doesn't really matter just trying to blend it into the hairline and this isn't orangey at all i'm actually really loving this oh and i just put a dab on my forehead oh boy i had to blend that out when we go outside make sure you get your ears this actually isn't working too bad you just have to be careful because it is a big brush so but i kind of do like color everywhere so Next, we're going to get the jaw jawline because mine is not distinct. I wish it stood out a little more. And blend into the neck. And it's actually nice out, finally. Thank goodness. I'm sorry, I'm like looking in both mirrors right now. I have a mirror over here and this mirror. So I'm just trying to see how this looks. So far, so good. Ooh, you can actually see it really good there. Hopefully it's not too sharp. I'm going to try to blend that up. I do like a lot of definition, so I'm not complaining. Okay. I think we're going to be done with this. Oh, I actually forgot to finish contouring my nose. I'm going to try to like... precisely do that not too shabby okie dokie so that's what we're working with boom and that was the contouring shade in the light to medium palette next what the heck is going on next we're going to be working with um, we're gonna just go in with this blush down here and then we're going to be using one of the two highlighters I haven't decided yet um, oh and I didn't show you my brush of course oh this looks pretty pigmented on the brush as you can see and this is another real tech no not real technique sorry moda brushes we received in a boxycharm box for March oh my god this is so pigmented you guys Okay, so there's our blush. It blended out really well. Um, thank God I use this like very f uh, feathery, like light brush. I'm actually just gonna dust this brush off and use this for highlighting. These highlighters look dark, but we're gonna try it out. Ooh. get up above the eyebrow okay 
get the tip of the nose lip um, um okay it's definitely buildable I was gonna say and I'm really not using like the right brush I could honestly probably go in with my finger I'm gonna try that really quick okay So now we're talking. Tip of the nose. Okay. So look at the difference. And that is with the finger application. And this is with the brush application. Not too blinding, but wait. Just wait. I love highlighting. Now we are talking. So this palette, I really like it. I think it'd be good for like traveling and just like you don't have to bring a highlighter, a bronzer, a freaking, well, I'll still bring bronzer just because I love bronzer and a blush and now my finger's dirty. But, oh, and I shouldn't have closed this because I have to put my lips on. But I think that is such an awesome deal to include that in the BoxyCharm box. Like, I would not. It does retail for, I believe, like 40 something dollars. And it's totally worth it. Cover FX is a good brand. But I would not pay that personally because I'm just cheap. So we're going to be going in next with the Ofra Liquid Lip in the shade Monaco. And like I said, we received this in March. Okay, dokie. I'm just trying not to put my dirty finger because I like to keep my things clean. So I'm sorry if I'm holding this weird, you guys. Let's boogie. Oh, wow. Okay, so obviously I just made a mess because I do that every time I apply liquid lipstick. My lips are just big and then I just like, mm, mm, I'm all around and then I make a mess. So excuse the sloppy application job. Um, I'll have to touch it up, but there's our shade. Monaco. I might actually keep this on. I was like, oh, it might be too much, but like, I don't know. It's definitely buildable. If you put more on, like if I would have did more, you know, a couple more pumps of that, it would have been like a chromey, but right now it's just like glitter, but it's still pretty popping. Mm. This formula is different from my other liquid lip that I have by Ofra. This is more like liquidy and thin um i do prefer the other brand or the other brand the other kind that i have better it's in the shade havana nights um i don't know if it's just because it's a matte or what but yeah so this is my look from march um nice to be with you guys again today i know i haven't been making too many videos i'm coming up with the ideas my boyfriend's actually gonna try to do my full face of makeup so that should be interesting thank you guys for watching the channel as always and if you're new to the channel make sure you check out my giveaway there's gonna be three winners and i'll link that down below in the description box thank you guys adios